afternoon. Now we're working developing news on a state trooper hit by a car. We brought you this story first as breaking news on Eyewitness News this morning. A woman has now faced a judge on charges of drunk driving. Pinpoint News Tracker takes you to the collision site, Interstate 295 near Route 7 in Smithfield. Let's go to Eyewitness News reporter Todd Wallace for the very latest with the West Bay Mobile Newsroom. Patrick, Rhode Island State Police say Amber Martufi showed multiple signs of intoxication and failed several field sobriety tests right at the scene. All right, what's your name, young lady? Amber Martufi is only 23 years old, but this morning in district court, she learned she's facing very serious charges. Driving under the influence with serious injury resulting. Police say at 1.40 this morning on Route 295 in Smithfield, Martufi crashed her car into the rear of a state police cruiser at a construction site. The trooper was rushed unconscious to the hospital. He was taken to the hospital by rescue, uh, treated underwent uh, minimal surgery this morning and has since been released. Amber was released on a $5,000 personal recognizance bond. She and her family had nothing to say outside. Amber, I know this is difficult, but do you have any words for the trooper, Amber? Amber, can you tell us what happened? Give us your side of the story. Martufi has to undergo a screening to see if there's any alcohol or substance abuse. Meanwhile, police and the attorney general's office will be meeting August 5th to review this case to see if there's enough to go forward. Live with the West Bay Mobile Newsroom, Todd Wallace, Eyewitness News.